Thoughts get lost in translation. Will it I met Ryan just a couple weeks after I moved to Orlando. I was planning on moving back to Ohio after just six months, so I wasn't really looking for a relationship at the time. Before we even went on our first official date, I knew he was going to be the one I would marry someday. We spent an entire month talking every second, making each other laugh with every word. And literally finishing each other's sentences before we even went on a date. Ryan made falling in love with him feel so effortless, so easy. When I first met Kelsey, I wasn't looking for a relationship whatsoever. I thought I was just going to be a cool girl to hang out with and get to know. Well, that wasn't the situation. Ever since the first day I met her and hung out with her, I knew there was something different about her. She did something no other girl could do on this planet, and that had sweeped me off my feet and had me fall in love with her. She had everything that I could imagine finding in a girl. She's gorgeous, she's cool. She's funny, she's competitive, and the best of all, her favorite sport is soccer. And come to find out, she's pretty good at it. But those are just the little things. What can I say that I haven't said to everyone about her already? We are a perfect match for each other. She always brings the best out of me. She understands me like no one else. And she's always fighting on my side if anything ends up bothering me. Today, I give myself to you. Ryan, I choose you. I promise to encourage and inspire you. Again and again, at the start and finish of every single day. No matter the season, no matter the year, I choose you. To laugh with you and to comfort you in times of sorrow and struggle. I promise to love you in good times and in bad, when life seems easy and when it seems hard. To struggle and succeed with, to fight and make up with, to love and grow old with, I choose you. When our love is simple and when it is an effort. I promise to cherish you and to always hold you in highest regard. Knowing there are still trails we must travel, knowing there are mountains left to climb. These things I give to you today and all the days of our life. I choose you to always be by my side. Till forever
Our wedding was perfect in every way, and I still can't believe I'm Ryan's wife. I have to pinch myself to realize that this woman is actually with me, let alone now married to me. Everyone jokes that I found my real life Prince Charming when I moved to Florida, and they couldn't be more right. Waking up to Ryan every morning is like a dream, and life with him only gets better with every day that passes. Watching Kelsey walk down the aisle made me realize just how lucky I am. I looked at myself and realized it was definitely me getting the best part of this deal. He's now my forever best friend, my adventure buddy, my personal back scratcher, and my safe place. I couldn't have imagined seeing anyone else waiting for me at the end of that aisle. The future I see with Kelsey is so exciting that I wanted to be here already. I can't wait for us to grow old with each other and watch our kids or even our grandkids grow up to live a happy life that we did and have her by my side through it all. I can't wait to see what our life together will bring us. There has already been so much love and happiness. I truly think it'll only get better from here. I love you, Kelsey Lee Manson. I love you, Ryan James Manson, my husband. Honey, we got a moon that's full and a dance floor made of grass. Your blue eyes make me wanna make this evening last. Put on an old song, put on that new dress. Tomorrow's coming, but it ain't here yet. We got stars outside, just you and I. I got this feeling rising through the ceiling. Deadlines, leave them in the nine to five. Let's not waste a night like this. Let's hold on tight. We got stars outside, and it feels just right. I got this feeling rising through the ceiling, singing. Ooh, ooh, darling, you, got you are truly one of my best friends, and you're going to make an amazing life. Oh, God, so We know more about each other than we probably care to. We've laughed together, cried together, and laughed until we cried. We've been there for each other through some of the hardest times in our lives, and we've been lucky enough to experience some of the best years of our lives together. We are a team, and not a lot of people are blessed to have a relationship and a friendship like us growing up. I'm so proud of you. My prayer for you is that you will keep Jesus first in your relationship and that you will be the leader you're called to be in every aspect of your life. I love you a lot. Congratulations to you both. Toast. <laughs> to have a successful marriage. Hey, one, two.